Is there a test for the kind of AGI that would be uh, susceptible to lead to S risk or X risk? Susceptible to destroy human civilization? Like, is there a test for that? You can develop a test which will give you positives if it lies to you or has those ideas. You cannot develop a test which rules them out. There is always possibility of what Bostrom calls a treacherous turn, where later on a system decides for game theoretic reasons, economic reasons to change its behavior. And we see the same with humans. It's not unique to AI. For millennia, we tried developing morals, ethics, religions, uh, lie detector tests, and then employees betray the employer, spouses betray family. It's a pretty standard thing intelligent agents sometimes do. So is, there, is it possible to detect when an AI system is lying or deceiving you? If you know the truth and it tells you something false, you can detect that, but you cannot know in general every single time. And again, the system you're testing today may not be lying. The system you're testing today may know you are testing it and so behaving. And later on, after it interacts with the environment, interacts with other systems, malevolent agents, learns more, it may start doing those things. So do you think it's possible to develop a system where the creators of the system, the developers, the programmers, don't know that it's deceiving them? So systems today don't have long-term planning. That yes. is not our. They can lie today if it optimizes, helps them optimize the reward. If they realize, okay, this human will be very happy if I tell them the following, they will do it if it brings them more points. And they don't have to kind of keep track of it. It's just the right answer to this problem every single time. At which point is somebody creating that? Intentionally, not unintentionally. Intentionally creating an AI system that's doing long-term planning with an objective function that's defined by the AI system, not by a human. Well, some people think that if they're that smart, they're always good. They really do believe that. It's just benevolence from intelligence. So they'll always want what's best for us. Some people think that uh, they will be able to detect problem behaviors and correct them at the time when we get there. I don't think it's a good idea. I am strongly against it. But yeah, there are quite a few people who in general are so optimistic about this technology, it could do no wrong. They want it developed as soon as possible, as capable as possible. So there's going to be people who believe the more intelligent it is, the more benevolent, and so therefore it should be the one that defines the objective function that it's uh, optimizing when it's doing long-term planning. There are even people who say, okay, what's so special about humans, right? We removed the gender bias. We're removing race bias. Why is this pro-human bias? We are polluting the planet. We are, as you said, you know, fight a lot of wars, kind of violent. Maybe it's better if this super intelligent perfect uh, society comes and replaces us. It's normal stage in the evolution of our species. Yeah, so somebody says, uh, let's develop an AI system that removes the violent humans from the world. And then it turns out that all humans have violence in them or the capacity for violence and therefore all humans are removed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs>